Part two of the uh, Kef Meta LS50 uh, experience. So, as you guys know, I'm a bit of a bass freak. I, I love listening to music, obviously, but if there's bass in it, I want to feel it, and of course, hear it if the main speakers don't allow allow you to. So, I pulled out, as I mentioned in the last video, that I was going to grab my spare pair of uh, 105.3s and uh, hook them up in stereo. Um, unfortunately, right now I don't have my, my subamp uh, Parts Express. I have to give them a huge shout out. Uh, one of the 1000 watt uh, ice power class D amps went for a shit on me. They immediately replaced it. It was on back order. I just got the uh, uh, UPS tracking number that will probably be here next week, probably after Christmas, before the new year. So in the meantime, I'm just running these two subs with uh, two channels of the 90-watt uh, uh, adcoms. It's good enough for now. So you have to have subwoofers for me personally. I mean, a lot of people, if they don't have the room, okay, fine. Just stick with the main speakers, which I was able to generate a 40 hertz tone, albeit very attenuated, just the speakers themselves um, with the... 105.3 bass sections augmenting the LS50s. I can obviously go down to 30 hertz very clean uh, without any issues. The the woofers that are inside my all all four of my um, uh, 105.3 kefs they're old, they're tired, they're dated. So the plan next year is obviously I won't have the LS50s in my in my future, but uh, you know when I get back to my 105.3s again. I'm going to replace the four woofers in the red cabinets that you guys have seen in the last few videos with uh, eight inch um, Parts Express uh, Ultimax um, uh, subs. Um, get some no res from uh, Danny Ritchie's website. So that's what's in store for 2021. Um, I'm hoping and the videos obviously right around Christmas time. I'm trading in my Macintosh MC50s for a pair of uh, Jolita, uh, not a pair, sorry, for a Jolita, I think it's a 3502 uh, amplifier, tube amp, it's about 60 watts uh, clean per channel, I think 85 watts max. Um, good enough for the top sections and it gets me into the tube world, you know, without having to spend, you know, a th thousands of dollars in order to do so. So pretty much that's the video for today. Um, all the purists out there, they, they already hate me for what I did to the red pair. Well, they're going to really hate when they see what I've done to the black pair. I've totally closed off the top section now, so it's basically a, a dual bandpass enclosured uh, subwoofer cabinet. And that's basically the video for today, guys. Thanks again. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. You know, all the best. Uh, thanks again to my 300 plus subscribers. Um, Shout outs to all the people uh, uh, on the YouTube community that have supported me. Um, you know, again, again, some I tr I'm not using my channel to review products. There's channels that do it way better than I do. But when somebody does lend me some stuff to try out and they uh, like, give me the permission to do a, a positive review, obviously, because I don't use this channel to, to do negative stuff unless it's my own stuff that I've bought and I get pissed off about it. You know that's different you know if i got if i got skin in the game i will bitch about it if i don't have skin in the game then yeah i shouldn't be saying anything bad because you know that's the way i am that's the way i roll all right guys take care see you in the new year unless i have something else to bitch about or or to uh, compliment before the end of the new year all right once again bye for now